All right, guys, well, I'm out here at the pond where I almost got hit with the golf ball. And notice anything different? The water level is down literally four, three, four feet. I mean, like, I'd be standing in water right about here. There is a drainage thing in the back. I don't know what, I have no clue what they did, but I'm hoping that the water can fill back up. I'm very limited to my soft plastics. We literally got like, I don't know how many inches of rain, but it was a good bit. And I was expecting this water to be very, very dirty and be pitching up on some cover. But it turns out they like to drain the pond out of nowhere. And now the pond is way more shallow, way, too much grass. Couldn't even throw a lipless crankbait through this grass. It's getting bad. Usually it's like this post spawn, but I mean, we've just reached pre spawn. I don't know. I just hope that we can catch on to something with these fish. Hopefully it'll open up a little bit or something. We'll just have to figure it out. All right, it's getting more dirty as we go this way. So maybe these fish will be on some cover. But I mean, those lay downs I was fishing last week, week before, they're just completely shallow now. So there's probably no fish pushed up on them. It sucks, it's sad to see this. I mean, I'm standing where some fish were. All right, let's see if we can get something on this chatterbait off this point here. Got a fish. First cast with the chatterbait. There we go. Oh, nice. First cast on the chatterbait. Beautiful. Nice pre spawn bass. It's not too warm, but these fish are probably roaming because. It is getting warmer out. It's gonna get pretty cold this next week and rainy, so it's a nice fish. It's good back. Oh man. Beautiful dude. Let's go. First cast with the chatterbait. I literally just made my first cast with it. I tied it on down that way, but then I walked this way to fish with it. That's awesome, dude. Nice. I was so unsure about this chatterbait, but sweet, cranked it.
right guys, well it's our second day out here and today is way different than yesterday. Very windy, much more cold. It's supposed to get up to like 50, but the sun is nowhere in sight. I mean, it's up there, but like, it's completely cloudy. So it's gonna get freezing cold tomorrow. And then the day after tomorrow is gonna be like 50, and then the day after that's gonna be like 60. And it's gonna continue throughout the weekend and the next week to be like 70 in. Yeah, and next week is my birthday, so hoping I can get a good video on that day. I don't know where I'm gonna go, but I'm probably gonna make it a decent spot. We're gonna see what we can do. I'm hoping I can get some fish today. I missed a big one, literally my last cast yesterday. But anyways, we're gonna see what we can do. Because it's windy and the water's more dirty than yesterday, this isn't bad for the dirty water, especially with how much it vibrates. But I mean, I'm gonna switch it up to a maybe darker, that against this darker sky, the fish can see it well, so. This is the one that I was using yesterday. Hopefully I'll get these fish to bite. So unfortunately we didn't get anything at the last spot, but that will wrap it up for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I know I only caught one fish, though we did miss a big one. Um, I just felt like I need to get a video out for you guys because one, it's been a couple days, and two, I can't really fish right now because, let me pull it up on my phone, but it is currently 28 degrees. I'm not to show my location, but 28 degrees and it will continue to be down to like 22 tonight. Yeah, 21 degrees at 7 a.m. But tomorrow we'll get up to 45 and then the day after we'll continue the rise of the temperature. So this weekend I will be heading out and trout fishing for some new species. So I'm not gonna say which one, but the trout. So be ready for that video. I am very excited to head out. I'll be fishing with my dad and his friend. And that will wrap it up for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. And if you're new and like this content, please consider subscribing. I will see you guys in the next one.